Oh, hey, dorks. How's it going? Happy Thursday. Yeah. Hi. Uh, how's it going? It's Unchowder. I'm wearing all my shinies. Uh, we had a community goal met net last time, so I have more shinies now. Hooray! We're playing Armored Core. Because I want to. Um, I was noticing the, the viewers for this game has gone down a little bit. I think I'm I'm slower than everyone. I don't stream full time. Uh, so everyone's already beaten this game. Everyone's already gotten new game plus plus. Uh, yeah, I'm still here. Uh, <laughs> we're in chapter three. We're still working through it. Um, and I don't care. We're gonna play games. Today's episode is brought to you by an overcast sky. That thing that I see today and I am so happy for summer is finally coming to a close. I know that a lot of people feel differently than me on that, but uh, I'm ready for some cooler weather. Personally. And alright, uh, I'm, so I'm just booted up the game here. I'm running a little bit behind brain-wise just because I've been working on other things today. Uh, here, I'll pause our music. I can do that. That's always good. Um... Working on a cosplay. If you're in my Discord server, you know all about what's going on. So join the Discord if you're curious. I'll have pictures once it's done. Should be done tomorrow. <laughs> all, all things, uh, if everything's working. Oh, is this, are you gonna work? There we go. Hello, hello, shinies. More shinies, hooray. Thank you for the shinies. Thank you for enabling me. <laughs> um, and then what the heck were we doing here? I played a little bit off stream, but really not a lot this time. Um, I think I messed around with, with some parts. But yeah, we have... We have some missions to do. We aren't currently stuck on a boss. I'm curious if one of these is going to be... Boss of Decision. I've heard, so uh, I can't help but notice the little decision marker down there. I was curious if any of these are ending a chapter, but no. Uh, there's branching path stuff in this game, apparently. Um, I was watching a video, I believe it was Iron Pineapple I was watching. It was also very good. Um, supposedly, and I don't know much more details than this, but supposedly there are there are branching paths in this game. Um, and the game itself, like one run through, is not super long. We we might be halfway, a third of the way through the game at this point. Hard to say. Um, I don't know how many actual chapters there are, um, but I want to say there's like five or six or something somewhere in that range. Um, but supposedly, so there's there's a new game plus aspect to this game because of course there is. But uh, the new game. Like, a new game, or New Game Plus, will have some some stuff that the first game didn't have. And New Game Plus Plus has some stuff that New Game Plus didn't have. So, we'll, we'll be playing this game a couple times, uh, I think is what's going to happen. Um, but anyway, that's we're, we're getting ahead of ourselves. Let's survey the uninhabited floating city. Because why not? That's where we're at. This is a personal request. Is it Carla? I still don't have enough data to pin down where the coral is gathering in the ice field. According to my friend's sources, we could find some clues here. Xylem. A city floating on the ocean oh. built by the Rubicon Research Institute. Ah, the Institute! Ever since the fires, that place has been abandoned. Going to the Institute. Perfect. It's likely hiding secrets about the coral. Of course. Kept shrouded by the city's ECM fog. ECM fog. My friends already tried. Eerie, creepy, to malevolent them, fog. Only to lose it in the interference. Mm hmm. That's where you come in. Are we going to be out of, like, comms range for the whole mission? I want Something. you to disable the ECM fog generators so that we can resume the survey. Huh. Right now, the corporations are preoccupied with the PC. Camo fog? We can be the first ones to identify where the coral is converging. Hmm. Fog generators. Okay. Neat. 
Deactivate all the fog control devices and survey the city. Got it. The ECM fog is going to interfere with COM until it's disabled. Cool. Follow the beacons left on the survey drone. Okay. Um, so Walter has a friend, and I jokingly think it's Carla, but I actually think there's some other, there's some other person involved that Walter's getting information from. He's had conversations with Carla about them both getting information from somewhere else or something like that. Won't interfere with our contact. Okay. It is affecting your lock on range. Keep an eye on your surroundings. Oh, air is here. Neat. Hello, hello. Oh yeah, that uh, <laughs> it's still bugged to hell. See, you see what's going on there? It's like, yeah, no, uh, the... <laughs> it's 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 funky. Uh, but here we're in the fog. Can we even scan? Where? Are... So okay, <laughs> that's water out there. I'm assuming we can't swim in that. I don't see any beacons. Walter said there would be beacons. Okay, not that way. Can't see it on dark mode, yeah. I mean, yeah, it's it's black on black on black, so it's not dramatic. Vegans? Beacons! Beacons! Walter said there's beacons. <laughs> oh, this maybe? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so I'm looking for blinky lights. You can use them if you lose your way. Oh, okay, so air is gonna. So yeah. Oh, I see. There they are. I already missed one. There's... I don't know if I need to find all of them. There's one here. Found one. No, you don't care. Okay. <laughs> it is interesting that uh, air can communicate with us with the fog. Uh, clearly, she is not communicating to us through like a radio or something. We knew that already. Oh, stuff shooting at us! Ah! Shoot! There we go. Uh, that button. Yay! Less fog. Hope you guys are doing well. I'm doing well. I'm playing Armored Core and working on cosplays. I'm in crunch mode on the cosplay. But, you know. It's still fun. Look at these little... All these tiny little buildings. Normalization process. Hi. Uh, what? Did you? What are you doing? What's? What are you? Can I not lock onto these? There you are. Oh, it's got like a, a swoopy thing. Oh, interesting. Neat. Oh, now we're just... Knock it off with that. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Oh, come on. Not even that dangerous, it's just annoying. Back here. See, I have a sword too. Okay. Such a good choice of cosplay. Look a lot like the character. Think that's thank you. That's um, that was the main inspiration. I found a character. Let's find the next one. Found a character that I kind of look like. Fits my build. Uh, and is from a thing that I really like. And that's not a thing I find very often. Uh. Everyone this way? 
Like we're sorry, trying to like talk and get annihilated at the same time. Hi! Oh, they're all jumpy now. Get back here. There's a third one somewhere. Go get back here. Stay down. There we go. Okay. Got that one. Aha. Uh -huh. On this way. Oh, this one has a battle log? How do you. How does that tiny little thing have a battle log? Do you have a bunch of health? No, not really. <laughs> okay. Cool. Not been a great couple of weeks at work, but have a cat on my lap, so I can't complain. That's fair. Cat lap does make a lot of things better. Is that this way? There's something over here. Is this a thing I've blown up? No, it's a thing. It's an extra thing. We might be able to extract its data. Ah, neat. Observation data. Perhaps this was recorded by Handler Walter's friend. Xylem remains fully operational. Planetary Closure Administration did their best to hide the place, but I'll find a way there soon enough. The, the only ones who know are the PCA and... What? And who? Also, the thing reverted... This. Why? Don't do that. <laughs> Go back. Oh, hi! Hello! Normalization process B2? That sounds incrementally more bad. Uh, where'd you go? There you are. Oh, come on. They're just freaking everywhere now, aren't they? I pissed someone off. And then I can scan that. Sweet. Text data, Dolmayan's warrant writings. Interesting. Uh, we've seen the name Father Dolmayan quite a lot. He's the leader of the... Uh, ba -da -ba -da -ba, the Liberation Front. Uh, these cats help us temporarily forget all the stress outside the world brings. Totally true. That's why pets are so good. Text data extracted from a wreck appears to be come from writings of Thumb Dalmayan. I didn't realize his name was Thumb. <laughs> a symbiosis. She seemed to be contemplating the meaning of the word. This moment of happiness we share comes at the cost of her siblings, sacrifices all. Is that symbiosis? Surely not. Interesting. Oh, hi. Got you. Or no, not quite. There. No? <laughs> there we go. Oh, it's the same suckers from the, the one mission. The stealthy people from the boss arsenal. Are those, who are these institute bots? That would make sense, actually. All the stealthy weirdness is coming from the institute. Um, and this is the edge of the arena. Let's get up a little bit. Let's see where... We're trying to go. Oh, come on. There's more. Am I just being perpetually hunted in here? There we go. Now we know what happened to the drone. Uh -huh. Fortunately, the data we found helps to identify where the last ECM device is. Perfect. Where, where is it? For it. Okay, yeah. Let's check it out. <laughs> uh, 
Uh, I'm doing well. Thanks for asking. Just a little sleep deprived. Yeah, that's fair. Can't remember the last time I had <laughs> six hours. Yeah, that's fair. The control device, Raven. That's the last hmm. of the control device. That's something off. We'll have Walter back after this. Yay. Walter will fix things. Six two. Do you read me? Do you read me? You've got PCA incoming. Neat. Pull out before they make this complicated. Uh. I'm afraid it's too late. Probably, yeah, probably too late. Oh, it's a big thing. Let's deal with these little ones first, at least. Complicating things. So much of something. You'll have to fight your way out now. I mean, that's normal, right? It's the same, yeah, heavy combat helicopters. The same as the tutorial boss. But now it's got friends. Oh. Uh. Uh. You're gonna hack things for me? Ooh. Ha! Whoa. Oh, you just immediately annihilate it? Okay. <laughs> Let's get the friends. Friends are good, especially when you have no health. Ooh, okay. Okay, okay. I can't tell if there's other things hunting me other than the big ship, or if I've already gotten all the small stuff. Okay. Okay, friends, let's do this. Yeah, that's always good. Of course, I have my sword still. Remember that? I think I understand this game a little bit more since the last time we saw one of these. At least I hope so. So it's probably gonna have like a phase two, right? Hoot, hoot. Yeah, there we go. That's what I like. Oh no, the bridge. Stupid bridge. Having friends to soak up some of this fire for me. Oh, it's something's targeting me. Oh, come on! You've come a long way since your crash landing on Rubicon. Sure have. Ooh. Where the frick? There we go. Oh no! Oh no! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on. I think I'm out of friends. Now come back here. Oh, <laughs> it's so little health now. Uh oh. Here's our. There's my last bit. bit. Nope. Yep. Nope. Okay. That's bad. That's bad. Okay. Okay. That's fine. Let's try that with more than one, uh, I guess with any repairs left. <laughs> there was at least a checkpoint in there I saw. Raven, that's the last of the control devices. Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. Perfect. We're just right here. Okay. Bring it on. Has it ever not been complicated? Oh, come on. Yes, we're complicating things. Let's find some friends. You'll have to fight your way out. Oh, she hasn't activated them yet. I'll clean up the mess. 
Oh, come on. Come on. <laughs> Try accessing it if you need support. Enemy turret left. Do okay, 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 okay. That's cool. Uh, who's that? Are you friendly? <laughs> Maybe hit you a little bit. Yeah, come on. Come on. <laughs> oh, jeez. Here we go. That works, I guess. What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> oh my god. Oh, I still got it. Okay. Good. 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 Okay. That was good. That was good. Now, where are we at? Shoot, shoot, shoot! This button, please. There we go. There we go. I'm working on it, Walter. What does it look like I'm doing here? I think I lost my friends. Everything's shooting at me now. Oh my god. Really? Oh my god. Okay. Oh, stupid boundary of the zone. There we go. I think that'll... That'll get it. Did I get it? There we go. <laughs> I got it. Now you need to freaking shut up. Because destroying the squad is the objective, so I actually have to. Okay, let's just... <laughs> Can I get more friends? There we go. Is that the squad? Looks like you did it. Got it. And cool. The ECM fog's clear too. Now my friend can get back to surveying. Your friend? When are we gonna meet? Okay, so heavy combat helicopters are easier now than they used to be. That's a relief. Jeez. We've improved something. But we also have just bigger guns, so that's not too surprising. No new messages. Oh, weird. Okay. Except for Raven. <laughs> the city's defense systems were still in operation after all this time. Mm -hmm. And stranger still, the PCA personally intervened to block the survey. Indeed. There must be more to Xylem. And to Walter's friend. Clearly, yes. I mean, they seem to think there's more to that place. That's why they wanted to go there in the first place, huh? Okay, so now we have two... Two decisions. Uh, one is on... One is on the wall. PC occupied the wall. And... The ice field. Destroy the Planetary Closure Administration Special Forces Craft... Cataphract. Cataphract? Okay. Well, so that's going to be a boss, right? Let's do... And that's enforcement squads. Okay, let's do this. 621. We've also got a corporate job. Check the briefing. Attention, Gun 13 Raven. This military operation is approved by Balaam HQ. Were the other ones not? Liberation Front took action regarding the Archibus controlled wall. Yep. Ultimately, both parties were suppressed by the Planetary Closure Administration. Yup. 
<laughs> Their loss is our gain. There won't be a better opportunity. But now Balin wants it. Oh my god. Everyone's gonna take a turn controlling the wall. I want you to head to the combat zone and eliminate the enforcement squads deployed by the PCA. Be aware that their forces include a new type of craft, oh. the HC. Oh. That's why we've chosen you. Oh. Balin's counting Hard on craft. you. Hardcraft. Happy hunting. What do all these things stand for? I still don't know what. Like I know what AC stands for, obviously. But there's MTs. There's LCs. There's HCs. That's fun. We'll make it work for us. <laughs> yeah, their money's good. I'm really curious what these what this decision stuff is gonna work out to be. Main system activating combat mode. This game has been very one do one thing and then do the thing mission. Eliminate all PCA forces yeah. occupying. None of you figured out. How many toes do they have for? I'm getting my ass kicked. Please help. Not the most secure of lines. Please, Jesus. Okay. I've made sure they can't call home for help. The rest is up to you. Yeah, Walter has some sort of hacky goodness. Oh, what's over here? Aha! More secrets. Image data, STV sketch. That's like humans. Wow. No, we actually seen a human in this game. A sketch by STV, a masked battlefield artist, said by some to be one of the last artists to dedicate his career to the art of hand-drawn portraits. Everything's AI these days. Uh, his works command a high value among collectors in the know. Old man seated looks like he's seen some things. Wonder if that's um. Hmm. Wonder if that's still mine. Cause this used to be this used to be a Liberation Front territory. So five target for termination sighted. In game. Yeah. yeah. Wow, they got right up in my face, didn't they? How'd that work out for you? No, oh, where'd you go? We're just, we're, one of these is almost dead, right? There. <laughs> Please stop. I love all their... I don't know if it's blue or purple, but I love their... like, the color of all their energy stuff. Okay. Harder normal dudes, but they're still just normal dudes. Keep moving, 621. We're getting readings from inside the wall. LCs are still tougher, I think. What's over here? More secrets? Show me your secrets. Oh, hey! That blows up. Neat. Nothing inside, though. That means now I need to blow up everything, don't I? I just dodge through them. This game's equivalent of uh, rolling through a crate. Okay, yeah, whatever. The cat is squawking. Okay, nothing down there for us. There we go. We're entering the structure. Oh, 
Oh, hi! <laughs> I've been jumped! How about you all explode? Oh my god. Oh my god! Stay away from me, you dorks! Okay. That was cool! Coordinated tactics. Jumping on my face out of nowhere. This is where we were. Is this the same place? Or is this like an identical different place? This is like the like a mirror image of the place we were before. Or we're going No, we're not going backwards. Still coming from the front of the wall. I can do that too. Moving to terminate. We have a shield. Are you scarier? Oh no, you're named Heavy Cavalry, PCA Warrant Officer. Oh no. Okay, let's deal with this one first. Okay, and now I'm out of health. Oh, come on. I can also do that. There we go. Now let's shoot. And we have some health. That was cool. Did he just try to kick me? No. Just die! Oh, you're not. You're gonna kill me. Uh, <laughs> okay. Come, team, come in. Restore the link with the system ASAP. He's no nonsense. I don't know that we got a checkpoint and all that. Nope. Uh, do I want? Do I want something different for my missiles? We're gonna be we're gonna be inside. I think I want something forward facing. Maybe we do maybe we do a cannon. Laser cannon. Y'all like energy stuff, right? Does that am I benefited from that? I don't actually know. We have to start the whole thing again. Ugh. But beating the warrant officer is probably the checkpoint. Main system. Activating combat mode. Okay. That's fine. These were all chumps. Checklist they never expect. It's true. We've made sure they can't call. Code five, target for termination sighted. Engaging. Get equipped for heavy fire. Hey, there we go. Come here. We didn't like that at all. There we go. Two repair kits remaining. Stay down. Okay. That wasn't too bad. This area's all clear. Keep moving, 621. Uh, Could have done better, but you know. So now I'm going to want to bait out these guys without taking much damage. Hello? Oh, I haven't been fighting the new HCs. These are just... Okay. Hi! Five. Target has reached the facility. Where's our control? <laughs> <laughs> Anyone else want to try? 
Respond with available forces. We need time to activate the HC. You're just standing over there? <laughs> okay. What are you doing? Nah, it don't matter. Anyone else? There's one more in here. Oh! Oh, and you're you're stuck. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that worked. Okay, now the HC and friends. Code five, solo AC. Engaging. Code two three, attending C. Warrant officer's HC. That HC must be our independent clerk. <laughs> Moving to terminate. Analyzing enemy. Administrate closure administration HC. That's the new HC. Station 61. Yeah, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Move, move, move. Oh, oh, I can't just, like, barrel roll out of there. Well. Oh, oh, come on. Jeez. No, that's not... Uh, I didn't... I didn't want to do that at that moment. Oh, I meant to look at the controls. I the link with the system ASAP. Pet peeve. Video game pet peeve. The clicky sticks. I I hate them. Unpopular opinion, I guess, but um I do I do want some sort of tracking missile, don't I? This is the, the forward firing one. Oh, I can even look at the videos here. Okay, yeah, let's do that. Maybe... Let's do that, maybe. Ugh. Yeah, okay. Like, just there... I wasn't intending to click the stick and dash forward. That's not what I was trying to do. But it's so easy to just accidentally click a stick. That was just a misprint. There we go. Damage. Requesting backup. Code seven eight. You already did. They're piggybacking on SG. Code five. Target for termination. So like click down. You do Engage. to do a thing. Yeah, exactly. Because it's it's hard to do when you need to. It's easy to do when you don't need to. And it's always like the most critical freaking thing. That was cool. I don't know what that was. Jeez, come on. How did you survive that? There go. How did that miss? How do you still have health? My goodness. There. <laughs> now you're dead. 
All but guarantees I will mostly do the thing on accident. Yeah, exactly. Like with the... Uh, now I'm out of health. Fantastic. Um, there's other control schemes for this game, but with this, with the default control scheme, the movement click is your your like dash forward, and the look click is would you like to be locked onto things? Those are both things that you don't want to press accidentally. Your patrol is dead. Bond with available forces. We need time to activate the HC. There we go. <laughs> Light shoulder ammunition at fifty percent. Like I am tempted to buy they they make those controllers with the paddles on the bottom. I'm tempted to buy one and just simply bind those to the clicks. Like, or, or make them do the same thing as the clicks. You don't think? So this guy is just gonna, yeah, immediately destroy me. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> Heavy cavalry. That's what HC stands for. Okay. Of course, it also stands for heavy combat, because the the helicopter boss thing is um is heavy combat helicopter. Whatever. Main system activating combat mode. I'm gonna give this one more shot, and if this is gonna be a total but total but, then we'll try the other mission. <laughs> Link tells me that's not gonna be easier though. Apparently, MST stands for Muscle Tracer. I like their little their little swarm misses. Okay. How do I do that without taking any damage that one time? Jeez. This area is all clear. Keep moving, 61. We're getting readings from inside the wall. I wonder if I can use any of these other doors. Is anything? No. 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 Okay. Already. Off to a great start today. Hello. <laughs> Code one five. Target has reached the facility. Where's our patrol? Oh, oh, unit. Patrol. External comms have been compromised. Well, we're the good in forces. here. We need time to activate the HC. Okay. 
You, you, uh, eh, okay. <laughs> Come on, you can come in here. I know you can. That works. <laughs> Have you heard of splash damage? You gonna come in and attack me? Anything? <laughs> Trying to peek? That didn't work, did it? I didn't work, did it? Okay. One heal. Oh, of course, it ricocheted. I get locked in. I I do get locked in. Interesting. Is this the boss here? Nope. <laughs> Is that too far, really? Oh, we like bust through the door. I didn't even notice that. Come on. Stay sharp, six two. Ugh. Fifty percent. How did that not do anything to you? There we go. It's not gonna kill you. My god, my god, my god. Okay. Restore the link with the system ASAP. Hello, how goes uh, stream and your week so far? Good. Um, this guy's kicking my butt, uh, so I might go. Or do we just swap out? Do we just swap out? Um, week is good. Uh, this, what do I what do I got going on here? Let's do let's do this. They do seem to have lots of energy stuff going on, and yeah, we'll try that. We'll see if that's any better. Um, packs of this weekend, and I'm currently working on a cosplay, and I'm in like crunch mode for that. So that's kind of what's on the back of my mind, or front of my mind rather. Oh, this isn't what I thought it was. Oh well. Okay. Well, it's <laughs> working so far. Okay. That seems to work. Live up here and I am dreading traffic. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah. Code 5, target for termination site. Yeah, traffic. I mean, because there's other stuff that goes on this weekend too, right? So, it's, it can be intense. Oh, speaking of intense. Come on. How are you blocking my Gatling gun? One remaining. And you survived? I thought you were dead. I thought you were dead! Okay. Traffic missed with a holiday weekend, yeah. 
um, and like bumper shoots going on at the same time, because of no course. Air kits remaining. I usually stay indoors. <laughs> uh, this weekend will be one of the exceptions. Hi. All units. External comms have been compromised. Respond with available forces. We need time to activate the HC. Let me end you coming. Okay. Do you like the Gatling gun? They seem to not like it, so I'm I'm, I'm gonna stick in with that. I'm already out of halfway through my ammo. How do I? Okay. Ugh, no promises here. Code five, solo AC. Engaging. Code two three, attending B. Come to the warrant officer's HC. That AC must be our independent first. Moving to terminate. Moving to try. Oh, come on. I'm not. <laughs> okay. We're gonna try and get in my face. I'm gonna succeed. Jeez. Tom team, come in. Restore the link with the system ASAP. He's just gonna keep dashing in like that. Should I get a shield? I've barely used a shield in this game. Um dude. I didn't realize that this was called the therapist. <laughs> oh, I do like that though. I barely even tried this. Let's try that. Um, and then for shoulder, I think the forward facing stuff is going to be better. Let's try that again. Oh my god. I need to sit down and like put more focus into, into all these builds, but... I've been working on other things. Oop, you're up here. You're up here. Code 31A, Code 31A, sustaining damage. Requesting backup. Code there we go. Okay. That wasn't too bad. On SG's bellious link. Not the most secure of lines. Code 5, target for termination site. Engage. I can fly too now. Oh, see there. I tried to do shoulder button, not click. Dodging. Oh, come on. Ugh, get away. How are there still two of them? Oh my god. Right hand. 
I don't know about the stun gun. It's good against the small ones. It's not. And I'm already have ammo on it. Okay. My shoulder ammunition at fifty percent. And I'm already out of whatever it is. My god! This area is all clear. I can't mess with my loadout unless I die. We're getting readings from inside the wall. <laughs> well, that'll happen quickly. Overheated. You're still stuck here? <laughs> this one gets so unlucky. <laughs> I'm like out of ammo. It's ridiculous. There's some other things I can try here, but I think I'm going to go try the other mission. Because, you know, I don't want to just sit here and do the same mission forever, I guess. Um, but as far as this, this, this guy goes, what if we did... I mean, I do... I am in love with the linear rifle. To the point that I should try other things. Oh, I should try that. He probably wouldn't like that, would he? Mm, pulse defenses, but he doesn't have like a shield. He just has... There's also this. This is really good too, right? Yeah. Curious about that one. Um. And then... Yeah. I also kind of want, I guess, for that matter, because I have the songbirds on both sides, but I could do one of those. Would that be annoying? For them? What if I do, what if I do this? That's like all explosives, isn't it? Except for a chain gun. Explosives and a chain gun. <laughs> <laughs> Let's blindly walk into the other mission and see what that does for us. Destroy the special forces craft. Give me a boss fight. This request comes from the Rubicon Liberation Front. Of course. Let's see what it says. Raven, we have a mission we'd like to offer you. The PCA has deployed the Cataphract. A special forces weapon specialized for ground combat. It looks big. If we allow the corporations to seize this kind of technology, things will take a dire turn. Oh, yeah, okay, it's... I want you to deny them the opportunity. Neat. Destroy the weapon first. Neat. The cataphract is a moving fortress Clearly. equipped with almost impenetrable armor. Oh, dear. It incorporates Does a look fun. MT as its core. Yeah, I was going to say, there's just a little dude in there. Threat. That MT core is also its vulnerability. Focus your fire there, and it can be beaten. You're okay. our best chance. What do you say? Okay. Well, I got my explosives. I'm gonna assume that that's what I want. 
seems the Liberation Front are hoping their rivals will wear each other down. Not a they must be bad hope. To avoid confronting a triumphant victor. I mean, it's been working for them so far. Except for like half the jobs we've taken are just blow up their stuff. Activating combat mode. Okay. Destroy the PCASP machine cataphract. Are we just gonna go straight into it? We're going straight into it. Oops. Probably want to stay behind it. Oh, it's got like a. That was pretty good. Hey, okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. That's a lot of missiles. <laughs> I think. I think I want to be in the air. Well, to be fair. <laughs> that was good. That was good. Except for the part where I blew up afterwards. Okay, yeah. Bazooka to the face. Gatling gun to the side is doing nothing to it. There we go. Oof. Can bazooka down its face, but it will destroy me every time. There we go. That's what it doesn't like. <laughs> yes. No! See, again, that was not meant to be... <gasps> okay. Oh, fun! I think I'm gonna get my fast one. I wanna get, like, up in there and shoot it in the face, don't I? I don't think I wanna be at range for this one. Because if I'm... Like, I could get inside the minimum range of those, uh... Uh, the, 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 the Gatling guns. So what do we got here? We got a handgun and a shotgun. I think we definitely want like I can't do can't do much of the big stuff, right? On this on this rig. Wasn't there is I got another shotgun or something? There's oh yeah, this. This this. How about a Zimmerman? Zimmerman seem good. Um and then I have a bought some more stuff. I don't know if I have a core that can or like an energy thing. Do this. Do it's a bit more, but like the cost of a whole bunch of other stuff. Um, and then and then we have these. Can I do anything else? Definitely want. What do I want? I can't do those. Well, let's try this. Let's try this. Main system activating combat mode. I'm gonna try to be fast. Destroy the PCASP machine cataphract. It jumps? Okay. Yeah, I just want to be, like, up here. <laughs> there we go. That was not... That was close to what I wanted. This thing's gonna be wimpy for 
taking shots though. There we go. Ah! <laughs> 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 Did not like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh man, you don't like this at all. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sit there and take it. So yeah, they think I'm raving. Ooh. Just fair because I... I'm telling everyone I'm raving. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. There we go. Come on, come on. So the back is armored. Oh, that's a lot of missiles. Yes. Come on, no, come on, come back here. Get back here. Shotgun it. Oh. <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on. No. no. <laughs> okay, well that's definitely what I'm doing because that's hilarious. That was really close. Oh, I'm never going to get that close again. Oh my god. That's hilarious. The handgun actually hits hits him harder in the face than I thought it would. If I can like just peeking in there. Yeah, like that. Like, jeez. That leak of yours is interesting. Yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Oh, that was not quite, but still. Back here! Woo! Get back here. Oh. There. <laughs> Ow, that one hurt. I don't know. Ow, 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 ow. Really liking the handgun here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. Oh no! Come on. Do the same thing again. Just, ugh. Ah! There we go. There we go. There we go. 
Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh. I like this one. I like the chicken legs. I like the chicken legs. The cataphract has been destroyed. Mission accomplished. Now. What about this Raven character? Borrowed licenses are always trouble. True. Huh. What are you and Walter doing here on Rubicon? Good question. Now the mission select thing so that there was a decision here. Did I, I make a decision without knowing it there? Or is it now? You again. I'm a busy man. Far too busy for the likes of you. Oh, shut up. So I hear. Must be a tough time to be the Vesper's deputy commander. Now that I've killed half Get of them. The, point. the plan to raid the PCA. You're going to need more pawns on the board. Of course. You're here to hawk your services again. That's what I do. Very well. I'll consider that mutt of yours part of the effort. One more thing. Show my hound some respect. Gen 4 is as good a pedigree as any other. Don't you talk to my little bitch dog like that. Show him respect. One new message. Yeah, what decision did we make? Or was like... Raven, thank you for taking the cataphract mission. Uncle Flatwell was pleased. He called you a valuable asset. Neat. With your help, maybe we can beat the corporations and the PCA. No, we need to stand on our own two feet. That's how we'll win. I wonder if the decision was taking that mission over the other one. See, that one's still there. Yeah, now it's different. Okay, so the decision was which mission to take. Interesting. So we did that one. <laughs> I mean, that was that was much more. Uh, I was much more suited for that one. So that's cool. Um. Neat. Oh, and I have all these OS chips. And there's probably... There's all of rank C that we haven't done yet. We could work on rank C. Oh, and what's next? Is this... Attack the old spaceport. And this is not the end of, a, of the chapter. Attack the base seized by Planetary Closure Administration. Destroy all birth warships. Neat! Mid-route rendezvous with friendly... Extra rewards based on number of enemies. Okay. Um, how about some arena? Get some chips. Oh, you. It's Volta. I do like this whip. I do like this rig. Um, probably isn't gonna be great for for everything, but I mean, it was great for that thing. <laughs> arena combat aptitude evaluation program. A giant tank doesn't like getting a shotgun in the face. Okay, Volta. I know I've tried this one before. Last stream. Main system. Activating combat mode. Here you are. This is pretty fun. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like this. Oops. Oh, it's gonna be close. Ooh, come on. Ha! No, I'm at one. 
thank you, terminal armor. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What? Concluding evaluation. Uh, it is the PC and PCA. Yeah, the PCA is the Planetary Closure Authority. The planet's closed. The planet's closed. I'm not supposed to be here. Sweet. Um, if you weren't there, uh, the t the mission where it was made explicit, we we were fighting some stuff, and then the PCA showed up, and we we fought one of their warships, uh, and we destroyed a warship, and then like fifty of them showed up, and they were like, "Hey, this is your only warning. <laughs> we're we're gonna blow everything up." So that's why um. We've pissed them off to the point where now they are showing up in missions more. They're actually like actively hunting us down, us and everyone else. Like they're they're fed up with all of the corporations now. Look at that head. Subject AC, dual nature. Call sign V8 Hater. What is going on with that head? Commencing evaluation. Main system activating combat mode. What are you gonna do? You got a shield. Got a thing. Okay, fine. Oh, I got gotcha. you. Oh, you had terminal armor. I get it. I get it. You're dead now. Concluding evaluation. Well Sweet. Done. Oh, this is growing on me. <laughs> it's tall. It's a tall head. It reminds me of um. One of the many generic aliens in Star Wars. Well, that's a weird. Everyone's got such weird emblems. Right? There's like some there's an alien like with the, the big scoopy front face and then like the the bits that go out. There's there's an alien that looks like that in Star Wars. Sula, we've seen Sula before. Thinking this build is all gonna be good. Number 15. See. Network instability. Remember that alien? Yeah. Sub AC in angle. Call sign Sula. Why are we getting weirdness in the arena? That's weird. I don't know what that means. Activating combat mode. I'll ignore that. <laughs> this is so annoying! Oh my god, I love it! <laughs> oh my god, this build is a bastard! Oh. Target destroyed. I'm very happy. <laughs> oh. Well done. It's so simple. It's like there's no bells and whistles here, but it's so mean. And I have like none of the cool toys. So I stepped into um I stepped into PVP very briefly. Uh off stream. Just to see if I could make it work and you know see how it work see how it works. Um and I did eventually find find some to actually play but everyone's already got all the in-game stuff like i like people with four weapons that i've never seen before and just annihilate me so that was real cool uh so i i stopped Arena i stopped pretty quickly evaluation program 
number 14, rank but, C. Where was I going with that? Oh, I'm, I'm excited to see how much better I can make a build like that, or like this, with all the in-game stuff, because this is annoying in the best way. I like that head, too. And you've got the, the, the little treads. Activating combat mode. When we're here, that's funny. No, what are you doing? That's a lot of missiles. Oops. Come on. You got a lot of stuff going on here. Oh, the stupid things. I could be in the air more. Ooh. There we go. Ooh. Okay, come on, come on, come on. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm using this. In my mind, the build is good at, like, doing the the jumpies on the ground, but, uh, jumping in the air is also good. Especially when someone has 50 million missiles. Main system. Activating combat mode. I charge? No, the pistol doesn't charge. And you recover so dang fast. But clearly being in the air is what I want to do here. <laughs> oh god, get up! Oh, that's right, his, his AC is named as Circus. I guess I should have expected this. There we go! Nice! <laughs> Sweet. Concluding evaluation. Sweet. Well Maybe we stick with this build for a second. Oh, it was very good for like the longer missions where you get hit a whole bunch of stuff. Well, that's a lot of. We have a lot of chips now. Okay. Who else? Just one more. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program, number 13, rank C. Oh, Final that's evaluation. so cool. Oh, I know what set that is. Subject AC. Yeah, Cross yeah, yeah, yeah. Call sign, Middle Flatwell. That's a good, uh, that's a good armor set. Commencing evaluation. Main system, activating combat mode. You want me in the air too? <laughs> oh, you put a big thing on the ground. I wonder... that's probably not a good thing to stand in. Yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah, just being being fast, using the missiles to kind of corral and, and remove movement options. And then when they happen to dodge, like, in your direction and you're right there, you just go shotgun. And then it hurts a lot. And you just keep the pressure on with the pistol. Like, that's... I like that style. I like that. Also, I like that logo, too. Yeah, are we C now? Of course we are. Congratulations, you have surpassed rank C. Sweet. We hope that our aid has helped push you to achieve greater things. All Mind exists for all mercenaries. Cool. So now we're now we're caught up on arena. Um. So now now I have twenty seven chips. Holy cow. Uh, we have our boost kick and our quick turn. Don't have... Weight control. Yeah. I think... Okay, so... We have terminal armor. And it goes into a slot, right? It goes into... The expansion slot. And I like it because it's it's passive, right? It just kind of does its thing. But these other ones, I think they're active. See, it's Y plus stick click. Y. Uh, but what are these? Okay, so there's assault armor. Assault armor creates a pulse explosion centered on the AC. Cancel out incoming fire and creating a damaging AOE shockwave. Okay, so that's probably what we saw. Uh, just now. Pulse protection creates a pulse barrier in a fixed position, providing cover from enemy fire until the barrier reaches its durability. Oh, that's cool. It's a bubble shield. And then pulse armor creates a pulse barrier that trails the AC, dramatically increasing defensive performance until it exceeds its durability. Interesting. Interesting. Additional charges. Hmm. I'm... I'm curious. Um, let's try that one. And then... These are all passives, right? So I probably want, like... One of each of these. So those are all good. Direct hit modifier damage tuning. Improves precision of attacks against staggered enemies. Yes. Absolutely. Oh, and then access speed. Oh, that's a huge upgrade. Holy cow. Okay. And then damage control. We have one of each of those. We could do Black Cost 5. Holy cow. Um, improves precision of ACA, ACS based bracing posture control. Reducing damage received from enemy attacks. I mean, that's... <laughs> yeah. Just straight up DR. Can even do another one. Hmm... I do... I do like not taking damage. And then what? We have four more. We could do more kinetic weapon. We could do... each of these. Um, let's do... Let's do this. I mean, kinetic weapons. Right? Uh, we didn't unlock any parts with that, did we? Um, and I'm using a pistol here. I'm curious if I could swap out like a laser pistol if I wanted to. We could do that. That'd be hilarious. That would be hilarious. Um, I'm also curious if I can get the the expanded versions of... Because I got there's the three instead of the two, right? Um, obviously I need more energy. Not even by much. I have more heads. I'll mess with this off stream, I think, but I bought, I've bought in some parts. We even have, we have some, uh, well, this is the shop, duh. 
So I have the th three pod on one side, but not the other. Let's grab, let's grab that. Um, are there any fancy cores in here, or energy generators, I should say? Nothing that has more capacity. Oh, but this EN output. EN capacity and EN output are different. Okay. <laughs> uh, what? Uh, can, you, can you tell me? Here, so EN output can support more high burden parts with the leftover output improving EN recovery speed. Okay. Capacity. Higher values enable heavy use of EN consuming actions. Huh. Hmm. I'm gonna grab that because I have the money and it seems like a good idea. Um, I think I do want to start just buying parts at some point. Yeah, like this. This armor is so good looking. The Fermiza. Hmm. Um, and there's different chicken legs. These are more robust chicken legs. These ones are also Schneider. I don't know, what am I buying? Long distance excursion cruising. Okay. Um, I go over here to my generator. Right, because this, well, that one has a ton of output, but it also weighs a ton. This has a lot of output and weighs less, but has less output, whatever that means. But that means I can do these. And then... Still don't have enough for some of these other guns, but like laser handgun, I could do that if I wanted to. Uh, I'm gonna stick with the normal handgun. Even do the rifle if I really wanted to. That's cool. Um, and then I'm doing like my like the max close range assist one because I want to be way close range with this build. We should buy more heads. I think we need more head. Um, and I can just... I mean, some of these are... Not too expensive. What's the head part developed by for the... Blah, blah, blah? Yes, yes. It's got like... Oh, I see. It weighs nothing and it has no E and load, but it has like no protection either. That's interesting. Uh, this is the head part for the, the set that we're doing. This is the fancy one. Body parts cost a whole bunch. Um, and for arms, I keep looking at, like, the firearm specialization and nothing else. I guess in that case, that's, that's pretty good. Then we'll just do we'll do the full <laughs> we'll do the full uh whatever it's called Noct Noctrier the full that set pretty good looking okay I'm curious to see how it does in an actual mission. Oh, I also meant to get more water. Oh well. I <laughs> will at the start of the mission. Hey there, buddy. Got a request hey, buddy. for you. Here's the briefing from my CEO, who came up with the plan. Hmm? Okay. This is V2 Snail. I shall brief you on the operation. You will be under my direct authority. Consider it a rare privilege. We will conduct simultaneous
simultaneous surprise raids on two planetary closure administration bases. One Good is idea. the of communications base, the relay for comms between enemy squads. The second is the former Bertram spaceport seized by the PCA for its suppression fleet. They're just going around seizing everything, aren't they? To handle the Harlov base. Okay. Now we're teaming up with Rusty again. Hooray! The objective will be to disable their He'll be way over and there. Prevent support from PC elite squads. And he's gonna fuck it up in the middle. We're gonna have to deal with it. During this time, you must destroy all the heavy warships berthed at the spaceport. Excellent. Excellent. This sounds fun. Plan, but there's a catch. Disruption yeah. of PCA comms won't last long. I'll come support you when I finish okay. on my end. Cool. We get Rusty. Are we going to get another boss fight? Is Rusty going to help with another boss fight? Okay, I am going to go get some water real quick. One second. I return. If this mission succeeds, <laughs> the corporations will deal the PCA a major blow. Ignore V2's snotty attitude. <laughs> Just focus on your own work. Blankety things. Okay. Main system, activating combat mode. Commence okay, that's so... All the birth warships. It's like you can see like an actual... It's like a front, it's like a weather front. That's interesting. That's interesting. Uh, anyway. Code 1-5, intruder detected. Sharing all base personnel. Commencing threat evaluation. What is this? What's no a little radar truck? Find your Harloff, buddy. Patch me in. I'll gauge the situation on your end before I jump in. Okay. I'm 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 growing on this. Wow. This pistol. This is a pistol? Oops. You have some help, don't you? Never mind. Oh, that was an LC. Holy cow. Holy cow. Who's... Who wants some? You seem to be okay on energy still. Oh, you're just unaware. <laughs> uh, so that's the way I want to go. So then what's this for? It's just a secret way? Hi. Oh, where'd you go? Where'd you go? There you are. Oh, you're a battle log person. Excellent. Oh, 
Oh, come on. Come on. There we go. Oh, <laughs> the Zimmerman is brutal. Oh, I love this. One repair kit remaining. I, I mean, we that hurt. We don't have as much protection, but... You know. Estimated threat range three and four. Contain the target. Oh, we could probably, if we had some songbirds, probably just nuke it all from up here. We're up to actually get down to the bridges there. Yeah, here we go. Maybe you should build better warships, PCA. Oh, we're already out of ammo, I see. That's the downside. Okay, well, I'm out of <laughs> out of one of those. That's fine though. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's see. These guys again. Shh. I'll just punch you. <laughs> Punch, kick, whatever. Nice. Okay. I don't suppose that's a checkpoint or anything. No. Okay. Oh boy. Oh, we're on. We're just here. Okay. Where's the last one? You're just... Oh no, that wasn't what I meant. Okay, that's fine. Right over here. I'm just gonna run out of all our ammo. Huh. I don't think there was a checkpoint in there. Nope. Can I swap out the handgun for my favorite? Also hits like a truck, but last submission, typically. Main system activating combat mode. I'll probably just do like dual Zimmermans or something. All base personnel commencing threat evaluation. I'm on standby near Harlow, buddy. Patch me in. I'll gauge the situation on your end before I jump in. Oh, hi. Also do like a melee weapon? That'd be kind of cool, right? <laughs> okay, that worked, I guess. Um, I suppose I'll leave the log guy. Target for termination, approaching warship. 
Estimated threat range 3 to 4. Contain the target. There we go. This is the one I didn't get last time. Even warships don't appreciate shotguns to their face. That takes care of their external comms for now. Keep moving. Okay, so then we'll resume how we did before. Yeah, we'll go take care of this. Where are you at? Are you? This. There we go. There we go. Okay. One repair kit remaining. So now we just need to blow up these last three. Target confirmed. Moving to intercept. External comms are out. What's going on? All good. I got this. Don't expect the comms blackout to hold for long. Just one more. I'm just not gonna bother with all these fools. I'm just gonna go straight for. Whoops. Nope. Hi. Bye. Thank you. Pull these up. <laughs> Open fire. Keep the target away. Bullet, I'm here. Here we go. Looks like you've got them all, 621. Now what? Hey everybody. Bad news. PCA's external comms are back online. Of course. But I'm done here. Warships heading your way. <laughs> Hold out till I reach you. Hold out. Oh. There's the catch. Resupply while you can, 621. Uh Ah. Hello, Rocket Fridge. Your cutscene is amazing. It makes me invincible. That's a checklist. Okay, perfect. Now. They're firing from above. I mean, I can just hide, right? <laughs> Prepare for enemy reinforcements. Yeah. Uh, okay, fine. Oh, hi. Code five. Target for termination approaching. Oh. Handle it. The main squad will be here soon. There you are. <laughs> Company six two one in front of the base. Uh, did we do this way? Okay. Did I just leave? Didn't I do what I meant to do? No. We'll try. Oh, here we are. Okay. Now they're angry. If 
I can do the same thing here. How'd the other one go? There was another. Sweet. Okay. And then another one. It's the only target I see. Oh yeah, okay. That one bigger? That one seems bigger. Up a bit. Whoa. Come on. There we go. Now we bail. We were just lacking authorization. Is that what it was? Oh, here they come. Code one five. Target for termination site. Time to pay the piper. First lieutenant. Oh, those are cool. Hey, look, it's Rusty. Hopefully. Yeah, that's Rusty. Yeah, looks like we've got high-ranking PCA officers. Are you going to stick around for a whole fight this time? Sorry to keep you waiting. Oh, he's doing the, the shoulder slot thing, isn't he? I got your back, buddy. Hope you've got mine. I got your back. I got your back. Especially if we're both doing the fast thing. Ooh, that was cool. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. <laughs> Boy. You. You need to settle down. Holy cow! Do I want to be super close to you or do I want to get away from you? Jeez. There we go. Ooh, 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 ooh. jeez. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. There's one of them. Now I'm at one health. Are you are you okay to get the other one? I just help you from way over here. Nice work, buddy. Glad you're on my side. No. Pathetic. Okay. <laughs> I can do better. Pathetic. No. How dare you? Uh, do I want the same stuff? I'm almost tempted to... Oh, what if we do the laser pistol? Oh, but now I have an energy shortfall? Do I need to do... I need to do this. Do I need a two and a three? I guess that's fair. That's... That's fine. That's fine. Let's do that. Go double four. Send me what you've got on the target. Relay the system response. Corporate agency, aim for a button. Aim to every mercenary and radio system. Data on the mercenary and even test where you've got the data. Ah. I didn't like that at all. Just made people can't afford to shoot. Oop, 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 oop. There we go. There we go. Just being up on the lieutenant. Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Jeez. Nice work, buddy. Glad you're on my side. Go three one A. Just a screen. No repair kits remaining. Oh, 
get back here. There we go. There's one. There's... There you are. Now I have a friend for the guy with the sword! That works a lot better, doesn't it? Report. Code seven, eight. E. Confirmed. PCA craft destroyed. Used a B. Jeez. Hey, you stuck around, didn't you? Oh, that's a checkpoint. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's me. Uh, what's that? I'm picking up something. Are you gonna nuke the planet? I've sent you a marker. There's something there. Identify signal approaching from underground. All right, Rusty. Oh. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Okay. Let's. What? What is that thing? Uh. That's a. That's a. That's a worm. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm evading. This strikes me as an institute thing. Oral response, yeah. Yeah, it's a sea weapon. I can't get a read on it. This is bad. Just focus on staying alive since two one. Okay. Uh and you'll you'll kill it? Assuming I'm gonna want to hit its head. Oh, now we get a cutscene. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Hi. Oh. It's changing its behavioral pattern. to What does that mean? Bye. To protect the convergence. So the PCA is trying to co-opt the sea weapons. They just activated a big sea worm. Looks like the PCA sea slug? helped itself to the Institute's relics. Yeah. But then it just like said no Six and ran off. Rest up at base. <laughs> I'll come up with a plan to deal with our new friend. Great. That's gonna be the next boss. That's gonna be the this chapter boss. Hey, we got the log. Well, that's cool. After the PCA sicked that institute weapon on us, Archibus and Balaam have moved to cooperate. Ah. They're scared too. IA02, aka Ice Worm. Ice Worm. It's a sea weapon. An autonomous deterrent created to protect the coral. The Institute. Why? If we don't take it out, why? It's going to reach the convergence. The Institute. Fight ahead of us. Now, I know that there's nothing it's left of the Institute for me to yell at, but they need to calm down. 621. Don't forget we've got a job to do on Rubicon. I didn't bring you all the way here for nothing. You want to explain? No. Okay. I know you want to get your hands on coral or something to that effect, but you haven't really explained more, have you? Three new messages. Good lord. Uh, Arena Bank B. Heard the news, Taurus. Ice worm, huh? You just keep tripping up over the Institute's relics, don't yeah. you? Yeah, well, when the PCA can huh. apparently just activate something them. something that might interest you. Sent you a briefing. This is V8, Pater. Your performance in the spaceport raid was admirable. I know, right? V2 and V4 left a message for you. But the arrival of that monster is more pressing matter. 
Archibus and Balaam have agreed to a ceasefire and are looking to cooperate for the moment. It'll take time to formalize our agreement. For now, I've sent you another request. I don't imagine the Liberation Front gets to gets in on that trees, do they? Call sign Raven. Your records have been updated. B rank virtual yeah. encounters are now available in the Frank. arena. You have entered the upper ranks. May these encounters further guide your technique. Sweet. Sweet. Um, and then I'm curious what our missions are. Okay. Eliminate Honest Brute. A dozer. Defend the old spaceport. Hilarious. Defend and prevent its recapture by the PCA. Historic data recovery from that tunnel. Salvage historic data scattered throughout the subterranean tunnel. No pay. Compensation derived from saleable data recovered from PCA racks. Interesting. Interesting. Um, I do kind of want to arena, don't I? V3. I've also been... So I went through and read all the other uh, the logs here. I, I've just been skipping over. There's like little blurbs on the side here that have quite a bit of lore in them. Um, so that's cool. O'Keefe is originally a member of an older generation of augmented humans. During the Island 4 disturbance, haven't heard that before, he worked as an agent carrying out espionage activities, later headhunted by Archibus, agreed to sign up on condition that they provided him with Generation 9 augmentation surgery to counteract the coral burn-in on his brain. Hmm. Coral burn-in. I wonder what that means. Sounds good. Oh, it's Carla! Oh, goodness. Uh, ringleader of RAD. Oh, thanks for the gifted sub! Thank you, thank you. Very nice. Um, Count of knowledge with an imaginative geni genius, Cinder Carla has produced a long line of eccentric and fanciful weaponry. Her stated design and philosophy, what use is a killing machine that can't get a good laugh? That's fair. <laughs> uh, cold call? Independent mercenary barking his way into... Into an effortless entry into Rubicon, having anticipated the extraplanetary corporation's forays well beyond they made their move. Fancy you. Specialist in corporate wet work. Removes undesirable elements on the behalf of those who do not wish to be seen. Quick to identify a fellow assassin, he claims that, quote, you can smell a real killer right through their AC. Yeah, that's probably true. Oh, and there's Rusty. Neat. Discovered through the recruitment program operated by Schneider, Rusty so quickly distinguished himself that he was selected to join upper echelons of Vespers in less than half a year. Received augmentation surgery prior to joining the Vespers, and though the pra precise details are unclear, he has declared himself to be of the 8th generation. Hm. Uh, and there's a cat in front of me now. Milktooth is your, is your mech name? Okay. Uh, hi. Leader of the Junker Coyotes, okay. Originally hired by R.A.D., smooth-talking, affable nature quickly caught the attention of Carla, who found him quite unlike the average doser. When it was discovered that the man was a psychopath and a pathological liar, he fled, taking considerable amount of funds with him, a loss that was too great for Carla to tolerate. Interesting. Interesting. I'm going to keep my laser pistol, because that seems pretty Arena combat versatile, having an energy weapon program. with me. Number 12, entering rank B. Uh, you have some big guns, don't you? Subject AC, Baron Flower. Baron Call Flower. sign, V3 O'Keefe. I like your colors. Commencing evaluation. Main system, activating combat mode.
You don't like that, do you? Nice. That's nice. I'm going to continue my quest to not ruin your fortress. Okay. Good luck. <laughs> Target destroyed. Concluding evaluation. Try not to lose well any done. more children. Ah, <laughs> uh, that worked. More OS chips for me. Oh, that's a cool one. This game is really hard. Well, confusing. Yeah, that's fair. Those are two different things. It's intricate. It's Carla! Let's fight Carla! That's a good word, yeah. There's there's a good bit of foreknowledge to, to really be good at it, right? That's all it is. Arena Combat Aptitude Oh, what's going on here? Program. Number 11. Rank. What is this? Strangers, don't you think? <laughs> well, whatever. Is she actually here? I'm not supposed to be. But you can have this own data. Huh. Main system. Activate We're usually not fighting like the actual human, right? We're fighting in the arena version of them. Of course we're fighting. Them. Oh, that's a lot of missiles. Ow. Ah. <laughs> oh god, oh god! Get away! No, oh, Carla. How could you? What are those? Those are cool. Those are cool. I want one. Let me have it. Of course, Carla has cool toys. It's gonna be a full RAD rig, right? Main system activating combat mode. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 50%. Jeez. Carla! Jeez, that's a lot of missiles. That's a lot of missiles. Does she need a, a bigger, a bigger mech? I'm still liking this one. Main system, activating combat mode. That wasn't what I meant. Charged my gun and then didn't manage to use it. Going better. I'm forgetting about the kicks too. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Take that, Carla. Nice. Don't know about the 
appears the data contained an unauthorized message. We apologize. Weird. Terminating evaluation. Weird. <laughs> There's weird stuff going on in the arena with all mind. Uh, with goblin body parts, they have the lock on them so dwarves don't touch them. Is there an issue with removing that so that uh, they tidy bodies anyway? Yes. Well, there's no issue. You should unlock them. Um, we have our garbage collection system going. Um, the main thing is that um, they're, they're standing orders and they're all set up to forbid all those things during a siege so that dwarves don't, you know go run out into the middle of a battle to go grab goblin parts, as there are still goblins out there. So the idea is that you wait until the, the coast is clear and then you unforbid everything and then a whole bunch of dwarves are going to come out and, and, and grab all the body parts and put them by the minecart. But yes, once once the coast is clear, you should do that. Or it would, it would behoove you to, I guess. Um, in theory, they'll be able to Stack them all in the in those two minecarts that go down to the incinerator, and that should happen automatically. Oh, you're cool! I like that color scheme. What's this sword you got here? Subject AC. Dead sled. Call sign. Cold call. Commencing evaluation. Okay. Main system activating combat mode. You are. Ooh. What are you doing? You're just you're just all over the place, aren't you? There we go. Come on! Come on! Oh. You're so close! You're so close! Oh my god! <laughs> I thought I got him. Oh, show me his health bar! Oh. Oh. Okay, fine. Fine. He's got some stuff we haven't seen too. Activating combat mode. Was good. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Come on, get back here. There we go. Gotcha. I gotcha. Target destroyed. Concluding evaluation. Well done. Thank you. I am liking the plasma pistol in this. And I like the other pistol too. <laughs> Strange emblem. Really? I wonder... The emblem designers must have had a whole day of that brainstorming session. Like, what if it's just, like, some babies? How about, like, a Roman chariot? How about, like, a guy getting an ice pick up the nose? Oh yeah, these all sound like great emblems. Evaluation program. Number nine, rank B. Hey, buddy. We have very similar loadouts. Subject AC. Steel Haze. Call sign V4 Rusty. This is gonna be a very zippy fight. 
Commencing evaluation. Main system. Activating combat. Where are we? Oh, we're in the... We're here. Weird. Where are you at? There you are. Gonna be, he's gonna be doing the same thing I am. Oh, he does. He got that. Okay. Oh, we need to. Oh, jeez. Need to try my new armor stuff. Oh, it's gonna be close. Nice! Nice! Wow, 158 left. Destroyed. <laughs> Concluding evaluation. Well done. Good job, buddy. Getting chips. He's got a. I like his. I like his emblem. It's also kind of strange, but I do like it. And then one more, Honest Brute. Do you like having someone go in circles around you a bunch? Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program, number eight, rank B. Oh, do you have the, uh, is that the chain saw thing? Yeah. Subject AC, Milk Tooth. Oh, I like that head. Honest Brute. That emblem. Holy cow, that emblem. Commencing evaluation. <laughs> no chill. Main system. Activating combat mode. Oh, you have a flamethrower? Gonna... Okay. Nice! Nice, nice, nice! Immortal, immortal Rudy. Uh, it was immortal. Um, this what was his name? Immortal something. I know who you well mean. Done. He is a bit swole. Yeah. Found that head in my own playthrough, although I'm still not terribly far. Interesting. I know that there's um, I know that there's chests. I know that there's loot chests that give parts. I have not found them all. Gonna have to do some scouring. <laughs> Sweet. Now we are rank B. Incoming call. Found it on the same level as a Roomba of unusual size. Oh, interesting. Rank B. That's it interesting, because I've done that. I found chests on that level. All might exists for all mercenaries. Right? Hmm. Interesting. I wonder if they give the same part for everyone. Uh, okay, so we're caught up on Arena. And now we have another 21... chips. Um, yeah, we, we should uh, we should install our, um, our pulse armor. Try it out. But then... We can also do these. We also want... That of course I can't do I'm gonna be one short of doing the ones that I want. I mean that's kinda of neat but whatever. Let's do that. That's that's quite nice. 
And then we'll call that good. And then I want to come over here, and instead of terminal armor, we should try pulse armor. Uh, oh, it is a video. Cool. And then that stays with you? Is that the idea? Okay. <laughs> we'll try it. Alrighty. Now we have... Oh, hey, look! Eliminate Honest Brute. <laughs> sure. I mean, I know I can. Let's go find the actual dude. I'll cut to the chase. I don't like this guy. This is about the ice worm. Okay. That institute relic you had a run-in with. A, a run-in? A run from? A chance if it were just the PCA they were teaming up against. But that monster is a whole other story. You can't just throw bodies at it. The thing that makes it such a pain in the ass is its perpetual reactive shield. Hmm. Coral tech. Takes advantage of the coral's directivity. Ordinary weapons can't touch it. So let's get extraordinary. I can make you something that'll punch a hole in that shield. But I'll need your uh. help. Okay. We'll be heading to grid zero one. Is that like a shoulder slot or sectors they built, and it's barely holding up. That's where a little rat who betrayed our ID is hiding out. Gotcha. Goes by the name of Honest Brute. His AC Milktooth was built by us, so it's only flaws that it's piloted by him. Hilarious. <laughs> when he ran from RAD, he didn't just take credits in tech. He also took a secret project oh, of mine. Oh man, look at it. And that secret he just ran off with it? We'll need to bust open the Ice Worm shield. Okay. Let's go kill him for real now. Ready for this tourist? Yeah. No one's gonna miss Brute. And we all stand to gain. I like how Carlo's just like fully on board with us now. Just destroy our Roomba to assert dominance. She's like, okay, cool. Oh yeah, okay. So this is the arena where we fought him, even. That's funny. All right, tourist. I'll tell you where cool. to go. Welcome, tourist. Hi. It's a you call me tourist too? Uh huh. Carla is a friend of mine. Any friend of Carla's is a friend of mine. Here's to new beginnings. This is cool. By all means, be my guest. Be my guest. Be my guest. See what I mean, tourist? We need to go deep down. This is cool. Who's... Who's shooting at me? There you are. Okay. Oh, hi. Okay. Now we're down. I'm really curious about these grids. Like, why? Oh. These aren't enemies? Oh. Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> oh, you're up here, I see. Okay. More lasers. Where are you at? You're down here. Combat log. Oh, nice. I didn't even realize. Uh, and then down this way. All the way down. Holy cow. Oh, 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 oh. Someone hiding behind you. Okay. I'm waiting for you, friend. Fidgeting anxiously before the big dance. I do hope I'll keep up, but the anticipation is part of the fun. Let's see what Carla means by no one's gonna miss him. Oh, another combat log. Ow. Something else wasn't there. I don't think I killed everything. Okay. Oh, we're going there. I hate to see my babies get scrapped like this. Oh no. Oh boy. Another combat log. How many combat logs are on this mission? Okay, now we're still down. What's up? No. Oh, here we go. Okay. Oh, hi, lasers. That was... that was good. Psst, psst, psst. I've done my best to welcome you. I do hope Have you enjoy you. your stay, friend. No repair kits remaining. There's a thing here. Oh, it's a chest! I found a thing! It's in this thing. WB000 Bad Cook. Okay. I... That worked. Okay. Wakey, wakey! For real, they don't, they're not targetable until they activate. And ammunition at Weird. <laughs> like. Oh, for real. Nope. Jump down there, and we've got him cornered. Okay. Don't forget, 
Now that I'm out of ammo, no, not so bad. Oh, wow. Jeez. It's almost like someone shot this thing with a giant missile or something. Is this place some kind of hangar? Oh. AC must be nearby. Okay, so I just am I coming up oh, here? My new friend, you're here at last. Damn. Brute. Oh, Carla, you've introduced me to. Well, that's right. You got a flamethrower. Wonderful things. Yeah, you need to shut up. <laughs> oh, did that miss? Did that miss at point blank? So much easier in the arena. Oh, come on. You were so close. Oh. What a weirdo. I'm not sure there was a checkpoint in there. Oh, there was. Good. Because <laughs> there was a lot of stuff. Okay, perfect. Now you're screwed. This won't be smooth sailing. Oh. Is this some kind of hangar? The target AC must be nearby. Ah, my new friend. You're here at last. Brute! Where? Oh, Carla. You've introduced me to such wonderful people. My goodness. How the rail can weeps. There we go. I do kind of want to shut him up. There we go. There we go. My friend, this is a gift. Thank you. Enemy AC is silent. You're welcome. What a weirdo. Looks like he's dead. Good. All right, tourist. I'm gonna miss him. See about retrieving our secret project. We'll need it to go worm hunting. Mm hmm. So I just, like, strap this on, right? I can, I can get the big, big legs on. I can just carry it out. Bad cook. To flamethrower! We got the flamethrower! Excellent. And detonating missile launcher. Hmm. 
I wonder which one of those was from the chest and which one was from the mission. Interesting. One new message. This is Chatty Stick, RAD. Thanks for putting down Brute. You're welcome. The Chief's already in the workshop tweaking the rail cannon. And I've never seen her happier to be at work. <laughs> that is all. Later, tourist. Uh, okay. Hey, that's cool. Nice. So what did we get? We got a flamethrower. Which we could totally equip on this build, but that's that's really silly. And then what was the other one? Was it a weapon? Can I remember what the other thing was now? Oh, it's uh, it's, is it going to be to to buy? Ooh, that's no, uh, that's new. Maybe first machine gun. There's all sorts of stuff in here now. Wow. Wow. Okay. I have to do some shopping at some point. <laughs> These ones are really funny. How does that take more energy than the other one? That's really weird. Well, it was a it was one of these bazookas, wasn't it? Detonating bazooka. I've seen. We've we've used that one even. Hmm. I'll have to go back and check what I we actually. Unlocked there. Defend. Prevent his recapture. Okay. Sure. Got a job for you, 621. We've received a request from the Archibus Group. Raven, this request comes from our subsidiary, Schneider. Concerns the Bertram spaceport, which you and V4 brought under our control. You're welcome, by the way. We've received intel that a stranded PCA fleet is planning to retake the base. Your objective is to intercept the PCA and defend the spaceport. We've deployed an MT squad to support you. Neat. Use them as you see fit. Here, here. That concludes the briefing. Good luck. Have they not been? Six two one. Don't forget you have MT backup. Main system activating combat mode. Commence mission. Wait, something's not right, 621. I didn't dig long. The battle's over already. Find out what's going on. Uh, that's probably not good. Are these the MTs that are here to support me? Nighty night. Thanks for hanging out. And good luck with the dwarves. Oh no, what's... What's here? Identified the target. That's the mercenary who took your name. Oh, it's Raven. Let's see how far they can fly. Okay. On borrowed wings. Okay. Okay. Needs a oh boy. Okay.
Oh, okay. Yeah. You're vulnerable to all the same stuff everyone else is, my friend. and I don't know what you're talking about cuz <laughs> I'm working on missiles well then stop trying to kill me Yeah? What do you want to say now? We'll watch this one. See where they go on a raven's wings. I mean, is he not toast in there? Acting like he's not dead or something. Okay. Interesting. Hey, I recognize that mech from the cutscene of a different armor core. Interesting. I've heard that the whole Raven thing is like a, a reference to another Armored Core as well. There was like another pilot, I don't know if like a player character or something. The independent mercenary who attacked you. It turns out that Raven isn't an individual call sign. Oh. It's a title. Oh. Oops. Generations of mercenaries who champion the free will Raven stands for. They Oops. choose what to fight for and take to the skies in flight. If that's what being a raven means... Thank you for explaining that. Then that's the name I want to keep calling you. Raven. Okay. You realize I don't have any choice over anything that I'm doing, right? <laughs> oh, nice! Oh. Nice. Uh, da ba da da ba da Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. Okay, historic data recovery. Raven, I have a personal request to no ask. No choice you. for right now for shattering surely. True. It's about the Angerbret Tunnel, which is to be shut down after it was hit by a coral surge. I want to go there and survey the area. You're sending me on missions now. Coral surge. That place had been all but abandoned. It's an old structure, dating far back into the colonization of Rubicon. There must be items of interest from throughout the planet's history there. You're assuming. You're assuming they didn't get melted. <laughs> okay. Aware, have a good night. I have no resources with which to pay you. Right? But I can propose an alternative. If you find any wrecks left by the PCA, you should try accessing them. Both the corporations and the Rubiconians are gathering data on PCA technology. Mm -hmm. Whatever you collect, I can exchange for credits and transfer the funds to you. The voices in my head are doing business transactions on my behalf. You've gone on a geological survey. <laughs> Thank you for doing this for me, Raven. Then how... how did you... <laughs> how did she convince Walter of anything? Walter is pretty convinced that she's just a voice in my head. Main system, activating combat mode. Let's get started, Raven. Okay. I've already located several wrecks that we should be able to recover data from. I'll send the marker data. Just wait until you start the boss fight against an enemy who doesn't fight against you. Only repeats, a man chooses a slave obeys. I know, right? 
I I've been getting those kinds of vibes too, for sure. Oh, now enemies have flamethrowers. Exchange it for credits. I think Walter might be gaslighting. No kidding. We can be uh, we can be certain if you find an underwater city. True. I mean, I am still waiting for when we go way underground. Still do think that's gonna happen. Oh, I see. Coral is able to conduct data and can influence digital equipment. Hmm. The effects of the coral surge must have brought some of the wrecks back online. Let's see what we can find. Oh, here. I'm not gonna make it. Oh, no, I'm really not gonna make it. <laughs> okay. Ooh, yeah, I was gonna say. You all just... Okay. okay. Oh. Okay. Hey. How many of these stupid little things are there? They're just everywhere. They're all doing stun things. Just one over here. That's an old bounce I see. The Rubiconians used to pilot these. Old, old. Bill Mines Writings, number two, I see. Uh, how long has it been since I first saw her voice? Fear not, she said. There will always be plenty. She told me this as I was imbibing Rubicon's blessings one fateful day. If I were you, I'd never allow this, I replied. And I was forever ashamed by my deceit. This seems to be a recording of Domayan, hmm. the Liberation Front's ideological leader. But this appears to be something exceptionally personal. Interesting. Oh. Easy enough. seems valuable too. I'm so glad this is turning into a profitable mission. Let's keep looking, Raven. An older generation of uh -huh. AC. Hmm. Wanna look. Text data Professor Nagai's log. Lost audio transcription for a voice log recorded by Professor Nagai, Rubicon Research Institute Director. Oh my goodness, first time we've heard that name. No, the coral tide is rising above, rising at an abnormal rate. This resonance, it suggests some kind of mutation. Run the calculations. How much time do we have? 47 hours. We still have time. Deploy Ibis. According to the time stamp, Deploy this was recorded Ibis. two days before the fires of yeah. Ibis. This seems to be about the warning signs of the calamity, right before it struck. Deploy Ibis. Yep, that's cool. Uh, still going on this way? Inspecting 
collecting data. It's a schematic for an SG craft. Are there any are there hidden things? This was this goes back up there. I got him. Oh, everyone's got a flamethrower now. happens when the bar fills? I assume I like light on fire or something? I want to look. More logs. Assistant number one has lost his mind. His research has utterly consumed him. Granted, there may be some logic to sea pulse sensory augmentation of human subjects, but no ethical scholar would ever dare cross that point of no return. No. No one. Mankind is driven mad by possibilities. What does coral represent if not sheer potential? This is about the first augmented humans. Yeah. The same coral technology The that Institute developed you. the augmentation? I guess that makes sense. We never would have made contact. I'm not Contact with a big C. Source. If this outing has made you think about Rubicon's past or the nature of Coral, <laughs> then it was all worth it. Then it has done a good job of exposition through gameplay. Okay. Cool. That was all the missions we had at the moment. So what do we get now? I'll have to take on the ice worm. We got ourselves a deal, Handler Walter. Hmm. Michigan. So, Archibus met us halfway. I gave them the heavy warship fleet. In exchange, Balaam's in charge of putting down the beast. They also offered some top vespers. <laughs> Guess they don't trust us. Better than nothing. I'll provide what support I can too. By which you mean you'll tell yeah, me to handle it. Mad scientist, R.E.D. or whatever, and that hound of yours. Michigan, don't underestimate 621. That hound always delivers. Because the game doesn't progress if he doesn't. I'm really interested about... I'll, I'll finish that thought in a second, I guess. What kept you, 621? Nothing. You're a famous mercenary now. Time to act like one. Sure. <sighs> this next mission's all or nothing. Make sure you attend the briefing. Prototype issued. Archivist Corporation is issued with you issued you with the following prototype. Shoulder weapon, stun needle launcher. Interesting. 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 Interesting, interesting. I like the implication slash headcanon that everything is referenced to by initialisms because the people who named them were all idiots. MTs. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Um the thing that's occurring to me now, and this occurred to me before, but it's still occurring to me. It's like we have, like we get messages, right? We come to this screen and it says, you have three messages and those are messages directed to us. But then there's also these interstitials where we're hearing conversations between Walter and someone else. And why... Why do we see those conversations? Other than other than exposition story reasons, right? 
Like it's this is like we're we're a single discrete person. We are only seeing things that are shown to us directly in every other context. But then we also just kind of get little snippets of conversations, almost like we're hearing them, but without any actual explicit explanation as to how or why we are hearing them. Like I'm, I'm kind of imagining we're like. You know, we're in some sort of stasis between between missions because we're, you know, not hanging out in a cantina sipping drinks or something. I, I figure we're like put under or something between missions and we can just like we can just hear things that are happening. Someone friendly linking you into conversations they feel like you should be present for. Could be. Uh, it could be, but it wouldn't be air because this has happened since before we met air. So it'd be someone else. It'd either be it either be Walter letting the letting us hear them on purpose or some other person that we haven't that we don't know about or it's just something that we can do on our own for some reason I don't know destroy the ice worm concludes chapter perfect well that's gonna be how we open up uh we'll provide Prototype weapon to ensure breach of the worm shielding. Okay, so we're definitely going to have to use that. That'll be a nice thing to open up next stream with, going into a chapter boss. Very cool. Um, curious how we're how we're doing. For battle logs, there's there's something there. Battle logs there. Battle logs everywhere. Holy cow! There's only a couple that we succeeded in. Hmm. Okay. And like this one, both of these, we got some in these, so there's just more. There's just multiple. Interesting. Could be that Walter is just really bad about hot mics. That could be. This game in general is kind of weird about hot mics. Like, um... Like we... Like when we're in a mission... Here, I'll just... Here, well, let's... We're just chatting, right? Uh... You'll be in a mission, and it's you talking or like receiving a message from Carla. Like in that last, like when we were hunting down, what's his name, to get the cannon. It's us and Carla, right? And Carla's talking to us, and we are traveling throughout the space, and Carla is sending radio messages to us, and then the other person who's there, the 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 guy, can hear that. He's like, oh, Carla's with you. How the heck does he know? How is he hearing? Like, does no one encrypt comms? Like, encrypted communications are just so unheard of that no one's on a private channel. Everyone's just, like, like using the radio as the equivalent of just shouting out into the world what who you're talking to and who's talking to you. Is that what's going on? Why? How can he... How are people listening? Like, and, and then with, like, with Raven, we're hearing, like... We're hearing Raven's handler talk to him, but not him talking to us. It's reasonably grim, dark enough. I know, right? But like, yeah, let's. It's weird, right? Can that just? It's that. Can I just say that that's weird? And again, I don't know if that's like video game weirdness or lot that you're not supposed to be paying attention to weirdness. I'm wondering if the, these are artifacts of the world being in, you know, filled with coral because uh, Air was saying that the coral like has some sort of information data transmission aspect to it, right? And it, it interacts with the electrical systems or that the core part of the AC has a good electronic warfare suite. I mean, that could be but you'd think you'd think encrypting your comms would be pretty high on the on the list for OPSEC, right? Especially for Raven, it could be because you were also on Raven ID. But that would be even dumber, right? If you could just pick up a lo could pick up an ID off the ground and then you suddenly you're clued into all of their log, all of their communications whenever they're nearby. What kind of security is this? Just revoke your keys. Generate a new key. It's <laughs> This is this is uh, amateur stuff. Why? What happens in the future? 
thousands of years from now that people just can't encrypt things anymore. I'm really interested in how that works. But it's not like they can't, because we have seen encrypted comms. Like the Institute people have encrypted comms. Picked up the idea and then Walter integrated it for you from someone who was MIA. Yeah. But like, why would that do, why would that do that? Why, why would, why would that, uh, why would the ID still do anything if, if Raven was marked MIA? You know what I mean? Like, why wouldn't they just say, oh, that, uh, Ra Raven's dead. Uh, don't trust that, uh, just, yeah, update our database. That log doesn't do anything anymore. And then, and then it's locked out. Why isn't it that how, why isn't that how it works? I'm just really curious. I'm really curious if that's something that we should be paying attention to, or if that's just... Uh, it's a video game, don't pay attention. Because there's so many things in these games where, like, you should be paying attention to those kinds of things, right? Not literally everything, but lots of things. So I'm, I'm just always curious, like, how much of that is intentional, and how much of that serves a purpose. Anyway, um, I'm going to stop streaming for now, because I'm hungry and I have a lot of work to do. Um, I won't be streaming on Saturday because I will be at PAX and doing fun things. But I will be back on Monday. Uh, Monday and Thursday next week, we'll be continuing with Armored Core. Uh, so come back on Monday and we will take on the Ice Worm. Yay, PAX. Yay, PAX. Yay, costumes. Um, yeah, that's it. I don't got nothing else to say. Uh, 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 today's episode was sponsored by Overcast Skies because we got one today and I'm so happy about it but also by you clicking the buttons down there like and subscribe and joining this discord checking out my, my, my cosplay stuff and all that um, that's, that's what I'm going for right now so I appreciate all that stuff and I uh, hope you stay kind